Well, the coronavirus crisis is leading to a lot of questions about what the fall is going to be like for students that are heading to college. All Indiana colleges and universities are still working on their plans. As CBS 4's Melissa Crash reports, there are many factors that could decide if students will be allowed to return to campus in August. We really need to be back on campus now. You set your sights high. Daniel Elsinore is hopeful that campus won't be empty come fall. As the president of Marion University, he plans to get safety measures in place. If things change, we know how to react to that too. So we'll take care of our students and we'll be fully operational. In an effort to support students, Marion is awarding 50 full tuition scholarships to seniors in Indiana's 21st Century Scholars Program. An effort to encourage incoming freshmen, their education remains top priority. We're not going to let a pandemic get in the way of an excellent education. Universities across the state are having the same conversations. What will fall semester bring? Our next major challenge is to prepare to roll out a return to work strategy for everyone involved. Deborah Curtis is the president of Indiana State University in Terre Haute, where timelines are being discussed for a return to campus, even if that means social distancing or installing safety equipment. It will not be like flipping a switch but we want to engage in a process that works for this campus. At Indiana University, faculty are monitoring the pandemic and more information for the fall semester is expected in the coming days. Purdue University has released preliminary plans considering pre-testing people before returning to campus or prohibiting larger gatherings. The University of Indianapolis set up a task force to review possible scenarios and seek guidance from health professionals. At DePaul, several groups are working on reopening campus while students work from home through May. And in Muncie, Ball State has a fall contingency planning group identifying and evaluating issues that may arise as they transition back to normal operations, keeping in mind what this looks like for classrooms, the library, residence halls, and more. It's our plan to start school. It's the conversations happening now that will determine what campus life looks like come fall. We teach, we discover, we learn, and we thrive. I'm Melissa Crash, CBS 4 News. Melissa, thank you. We have included full statements from the universities on our website. Like you heard, IU does plan to release more information in the coming days.